Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 3 and today I will show you how to enable and set up the portable hotspot. Now to get started all you want to do is pull down your notification panel and look for the hotspot toggle which for me looks to be not toggled I think. Oh no there it is, mobile hotspot. So once you find it you can hold the toggle uh, this will usually quickly take you to the settings. I just need to first disable airplane mode, which for some reason is enabled. And now I can hold it and this will take me to the settings. I'm not exactly sure why you can't edit the settings while you're in airplane mode. It's not like you're going in here and automatically turning it on, but it's Samsung, so I don't expect much. So anyway, uh, in here, uh, we want to probably start off by selecting the password or configure and then password. And removing this one because let's be honest, the password uh, re that is randomly generated is not the greatest. So you can set your own. It does need to have eight characters in length, at which point you will be able to save it. Now, additionally, you can also change the name of the Wi Fi right here that the device will create. And below here, we have also the Wi Fi band, so we have 2.4 or 5 gigahertz to choose from. And now, if you're not exactly sure what this is, a uh, quick quick definition of this would be uh, 2.4 works on every device 5 gigahertz does not but is faster and more stable connection um, older devices will not support the 5 gigahertz uh, but they will basically every device will support 2.4 uh, what I could recommend you to do is turn on 5 gigahertz if your device just doesn't see it then your device just doesn't support it and all you need to do is go back here into the settings and change it to, to 2.4 if your device sees the Wi-Fi then you're all set. You don't need to do anything extra. It supports 5 gigahertz and you're all set. So from here, select save. And once you have configured it, you can enable it from here, or you can also enable it from here, or additionally also disable it. Now I do recommend you to disable your hotspot when you're done with it, because it does consume more of your battery life. And this device doesn't have much from start to start off with. So yeah. Uh, and what we need to do to disable it is click on it again like so and now it's off so if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching